Today's word for the day, don't reject the word of the Lord. There are severe consequences for doing so. Keep that word in your heart. Don't reject the word of the Lord. Receive the word of the Lord. Embrace the word of the Lord. Mix it with faith and run with it. The word of the Lord comes to us in various forms through instruction, through correction, through teaching, through parents, through siblings, through friends, through pastors and teachers. However they come to you, friend, receive it. Don't reject it. In 1 Samuel chapter 15, God sent the prophet Samuel to go to the king, the first king of Israel, Saul. And this is what the message was. He said, Saul, the Lord has rejected you as king because you rejected his word. The word of God. That's it. Friend, rejecting the word of God has consequences and you don't want to deal with the consequences. So please receive the word of the Lord. In our culture, we tend to reject the word of the Lord. We tend to downplay the word of the Lord. We tend to dim diminish the word of the Lord. Friend, receive the word of the Lord. There are consequences for rejecting the word of the Lord. The Lord will reject you. That's the word of the day. Meditate on it and keep it in your heart. I'm Pastor Frederick Madison from Rima International Bible Church here in Silver Spring, Maryland. If you are ever visiting our area, I invite you to join us for worship. We begin our services at 11.30. If you're not local, continue following us on our social media platforms, YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram. And please help us share this word so your community is blessed. God bless you. God willing, I'll be back again with another word for the day.